Hi, welcome to with Brian J's channel. I'm Brian, and in this video, ipapakita ko siyo kung paano mo ma-emphasize or ma-highlight yung subject mo using Premiere Pro. Gagamitin natin yung Lumetri effect and masking dito sa tutorial na to. So let's begin. This is our sample clips. And the first one is steady lang si subject. The next is si moving. Let's start with this clip na hindi nagbago yung position ni subject. Go to color workspace and Lumetri panel. Alright, so once na may adjust tayo dito sa Lumetri panel, automatic na mapupunta yung Lumetri effects sa clip na nakaselect. First thing na gagawin ko, aayusin ko muna yung exposure. So medyo hindi siya nagbabalance between sa highlights natin and shadows, but I will adjust it na hindi mag-overexpose. So once you're okay with the exposure, next is duplicate the clip. Press Alt to duplicate, then drag lang sa taas. Remember, kailangan pantay siya. Then go to Effect Controls, and dito sa Opacity, select the Pen Tool. Ngayon, start na tayo mag-mask. Ang nakakatuwa lang dito, kahit hindi perfect masking, nag-work pa rin siya. So, paikutan lang natin sa subject. And once you're done, i-adjust mo na ngayon yung background. You can apply lots or kung paano mo siya i-color grade. For this video, I will apply lots. So go to creative, then hanap tayo ng lot. So hanap lang tayo ng bagay sa fill ng video. The reason kung bakit ako dito pumili is para ma-adjust natin yung intensity ng lot. The next is a subject. Konting angat ng exposure, then contrast. And in this video, hindi ko nalalagyan ng lot sa subject to have a balanced skin tone. Minsan kasi yung ibang lots, medyo unnatural na yung skin tone niya eh. So, I'm good with this. If mapapansin mo dito, medyo sharp yung edges. So, ang gagawin natin, adjust lang yung feather. So, we can do 50 to 100. Or you can experiment naman sa amount ng feather as long as mag-blend na siya sa background. Okay, so next is yung moving subject. Okay, so same concept lang tayo dun sa first part. Duplicate, mask, and adjust color or exposure. So since na gumagalaw si subject, what we can do is to assign or put keyframes. Punta ka dito sa start ng clip, then click the stopwatch or the toggle animation. 
Then click the play button or track selected mask forward. So ito track niya automatically si subject para sumunod sa kanya yung mask mo. In some instances, hindi ganun ka-accurate yung tracking, so imamanual mo siya. You can track it frame by frame, depende sa movement, or in some scenario, you can keyframe sa first, then go to the last frame, then manually adjust the mask. And we're good! So sana may natutunan ka sa video natin ngayon. And remember, trial and error pa rin to hanggang sa masatisfy ka sa resulta. If you're new to this channel, you can subscribe and hit the notification bell para ma-notify ka once we uploaded new videos. So once again, I'm Brian. Thank you for watching and always do what you love.